folks. So this is hashtag Bill uh, Maris goes Oceanside. So Maris Otter. Um, for some reason, I was thinking like um, Emmett the Otter. That's what first popped in my head on the Otter the Christmas special. Um, this is a beer by Timber Ales, a collaboration with with Horish. Oh, Horish. Jesus. Horace Aged Ales and Mindful. Uh, this is courtesy of my buddy Angel. Um, when I got the beer and I was trying to read the, the the collabs in the in the unboxing video, I totally butchered Mindful. And then I was Googling it to um to do the hashtags on Instagram, um, tag them on Instagram, and I was like, Mindful. Yeah, that makes so much more sense now. Uh, but anyways, this is a English style barley wine with coffee. Um, 11%. Tonight is um, second night of WrestleMania. No fans taped two weeks ago so this should be a good beer to um kind of sip and watch it with um but i really wanted to do this one um angel will tell me this is actually his buddy's brewery timber ales um they're out of it's uh new haven uh, sorry north haven connecticut north haven is there a new haven north haven connecticut uh this is distributed by 12 percent, so they're doing um they have like a uh, nightmare brewing and other stuff but anyways um yeah just took this out of the fridge it was in my stout fridge or my dark beer fridge i guess so it's got a nose. Uh, no, actually, no. For a look, ooh, yeah, that looks freaking awesome. That is, let's see how that looks on camera. Now it looks like a stud on camera, but in the light, it is nice dark brown. Like, oh, and then like alcohol legs on this. Let's see if we can get. Yeah, that looks. That looks the part for sure. That looks the part. It's definitely like a dark murky brown um, nose. This beer is very, very, very fresh, I believe. Uh, okay, 124. But yeah, for a barley wine, yeah, that's perfect, right? So it's almost uh, February, March. Three months old? Uh, a little under three. Oh, yeah, that smells like toffee, caramel, sweet caramelized sugar, which is what caramel is, I believe. Not getting much coffee, but... Yeah, you're getting that like, uh, yeah, that that English mild. Like what do you get out of a, uh, an English mild, which is like a lower ABV beer. This smells outstanding. A little bit. Yeah, the coffee's there. The coffee's there. It's very subtle, but it's there. Um, this definitely smells more like an English barley wine than an American barley wine, because you're getting that more ca caramel toffiness. Um, and that, that English mild, like the lower ABV English mild, I'm getting that on the on the nose. Cheers. That is 110% what I want in an English barley wine. It's 110% what I want right now, what I want to watch WrestleMania with. This beer is magnificent. It's the perfect temperature, too. Mouthfeel. It's creamy. It's smooth. And it just coats your mouth, and it's got this like sweet, dark toffee, molasses. Coffee doesn't really come through on the flavor, which I'm perfectly fine with. Like if this had some coffee in it, and I, I mean, if it the coffee came through more, it'd be fine. But this is outstanding. You get some dark fruits, some of that toffee, sweetness, sugary sweetness. Um, it coats your it coats your mouth. It leaves your your lips sticky sweet. You've got a perfect amount of carbonation. It's dangerous. It's 11%. It drinks very nicely. It's not, there's no burn, um, but it's a heavy beer, but I kind of want to keep drinking it just because it tastes so, tastes so damn great. Right there I got, as it lingers, yeah, almost like stone fruits. 
like this fruitiness that not berry fruits that I've been getting from stouts lately, but it's like darker fruit, stony fruit. But it's really that punch forward, like I said, toffee. And I'm repeating myself, so I'm going to start to wrap this up. If you can get this beer, get this beer. Um, this is, I haven't had a barley wine this great in a while. Um, I love, bar, I do, I don't, I wouldn't say I love barley wines. I really like barley wines, wheat wines, whatever, what have you. Um, but this is outstanding, world class. Um, I sort of wish I, I knew that this wasn't as coffee for it. I would have saved it for Mike. But um, yeah, Timber Ales. Um, I know that I think they're, I believe they're relatively new. Um, so yeah, if you guys have had anything by these guys, let me know in the comments what else they make that that's great. If you've had hashtag bill, uh, this can art actually is really freaking gorgeous too. Hold on. Let me see if I can like the artwork is outstanding. I don't see, uh, any artist names or anything like that on it, but, uh, yeah, it's it's a gorgeous, gorgeous can art. Um, I'll look it up after see if I can link to it. Um, yeah, this barley one is is hands down one of the best barley ones I've I've, I've had in a long time. Um, it's up there. It's absolutely delicious. So down in the comments, if you had hashtag Bill, uh, what you think of it? What you think of Timberers in general? And also, obviously, uh, collaboration with Horace Agedales and Mindful. And uh, yeah, no sense on that. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, if those are your things, please like, comment, subscribe, and hit those notification bells. Ding, ding. And uh, I'm Sean. This is Nerd Sense. Cheers.